Go, Dan here. About to go on a bike mission to um, a little lake and a dam. Take the um, the 100 to 400 lens. Get some landscape shots there. Some nice tight shots. And uh, yeah, it's a perfect morning for it. Let's go. Using the GoPro Hero 7 Splat, which is uh, awesome with the stabilization. I'm just holding this with my hand on the uh, pole, and uh, it's, it's so much better than all the other GoPros so far. And uh, yeah, it's, it's, yeah, as you can see by the quality here. And I think they've also improved the light quality as well. So there's a little bit of uh, breeze as I'm as I'm cycling here. I am shooting with uh, just low raw mic audio. Uh, you can have uh, medium and high process as well or you can turn that off. I'm nearly at the dam. Just come across a horse. It's pretty cool. Nice and friendly. What I might do is I might try to get some shots of it with the uh, 100 to 400. I got a few shots of the uh, horse and um, yeah, it was pretty cool. Did a few yawns, so got some nice shots there. And uh, now I'll head onto the dam and then further so I've got a nice spot here. Um, I'm kind of looking through the grass and then onto the dam uh, with the, the nice flat water and the rocks behind. So I'll go for a little adventure down to that rock there, see if I can get any shots. Yeah, I might be able to get a few shots here. So I was a bit limited there, couldn't really get any shots. I got one shot of, I uh, thought it was kind of cool with my shadow and then the waterfall. I'm gonna jump back on my bike and then uh, head on further up, up the, the lake there and see what I can get. I've got a few hills to climb, but uh, I just noticed that I don't have any uh, charge GoPro batteries because I didn't really come prepared. I wasn't going to do a video today, but anyway, this is probably the last video on the GoPro, so I don't have these point of view shots. What I'll do is I'm just going to use the uh, Sony. Yay, finally some downhill. Yeah, so like I said, uh, the GoPro batteries are gone, so I uh, switched out the 100 to 400 to the 24 to 240. And um, yeah, I'll take a few on the Sony and then I'll, I'll put this back on and do some, some shots around here. It looks pretty amazing. Okay, so I'm going to jump back on my bike and then I'm going to head up the lake a little bit more. Okay, it's got a good reflection, as you can see. So uh, yeah, I've got the 24 to 240, so I'm just going to leave that on. Um, just take some photos here with that, get a bit wider. Saw these rocks in the distance and some birds on them, shags. So I'm going to put it on speed continuous and uh, also um, at the moment I've got it on spot, spot focus but I might put it on continuous focus and uh, I'm going to keep going closer and then if they do fly then at least I can try to get a burst or um, try and catch them in flight. I'm just going to walk up there and uh, I'll put the 100 400 back on, take a few uh, landscape shots of the surrounding countryside, like uh, the rock formations. 
Okay, so I made it up the top here. Um, as you can tell, I can't do any selfies because I've got 100 to 400 on. What's drawn me is the uh, fence line. So it looks uh, nice and it's leading into the shot here, down into the, um, there's a road as well, and then into the distance. A few trees, they look like they're the, yeah, they're dead. Yeah, you got all these rock formations. And what I'm gonna do here is compose it with the fence line on the left leading into the shot. So that's it for this video. I've got a few videos coming up. Gonna do a mountain bike and hike up a mountain and then I'll take some photos, so keep an eye out for that. Yeah, cheers for watching.